Hello and welcome to the section Go and Concurrency. In this section you'll be learning some tips and tricks that you can use when working with concurrency. We'll start with having a more thorough look at the SELECT statement. As a prerequisite for this video, you should already know about Go routines and channels. But just to refresh your memory, let's have a really quick look back at what channels are and how they work. A channel is a data structure that allows you to easily pass data from one Go routine to another. It can be constructed using the make statement. You can write into a channel using the channel operator. That same operator can also be used to read from a channel. By default, the channel operator is blocking. When writing to a channel, the operator will block the Go routine until another Go routine reached from that channel. And the same also applies the other way around. Since reading from a channel is blocking, it gets difficult to read from multiple channels at once. This is often the case when you want to process data from multiple channels and you want to do this processing in a single Go routine. Also, many libraries often implement interfaces that return separate result and error channels for you to consume. This snippet shows a real-world example using the Stratway AMQP library. In this library, you can register event listeners at a connection and each listener is a channel that you'll need to construct beforehand into which the connection will publish the respective events when they occur. For example, in this case, when a message is cancelled or when the connection was closed. One way to have a Go routine consume messages from multiple channels is the SELECT statement, shown in the example on the right. Each SELECT statement can have any number of case statements, each reading from a different channel. The SELECT statement will block until one of the read statements actually completed. And as shown in this example, you can also use it in a for loop to repeatedly read from multiple channels.